This is the sixth video of the Wargaming of Napoleon's Waterloo Campaign. And this includes all four, an area of all four battlefields. Plus, it goes up to Brussels and down as far south as Charleroi on the French-Belgian um, border. I am playing the French, and the game's artificial intelligence is playing the British and Prussians. It is June 15, 1815, 1.45 p.m., uh, turn 14 out of 388. And it is the French movement phase. So let us get our recorder timer out here. Let us switch our view to map elevations. And let's turn off objectives. Let's see if I've moved some of this stuff. Ugh, looks like I've moved these guys. These guys. Okay. Oh, looks like I've moved these guys. Yeah, they're all set for melees. Oops, up here. Deployed him, that's good. Yep, there goes the furnace, like usual. It's right in back of me, so you're gonna hear some noise for a couple of minutes as the blower turns up. Um, probably can't put this guy into school into line. Nope, not enough movement. Skirmishers, okay, so this guy will melee them. This guy's disordered. What the hell is he gonna do? Well. Well, this guy's in line, good. Alright, so we're good there. Oh, if this guy could just move one more hex. Hey, shit, he can. That's great. I'll melee these two batteries. These guys have maxed out. Oh, that, that was good news. That was excellent news. This cavalry is disordered. So, since he's disordered anyway... We should move around here and occupy some advanced positions. These guys have moved. This guy's moved. Okay, so it looks like these guys have moved. Christ. Oh, we got a bunch of melees set up here. That's excellent. Okay, we're doing good there. We'll see if this guy charges. I almost hope he does, because then he'll be spent. Uh, that guy's moved, so this stuff's all... It looks like I might have taken all my moves. Nope, this guy's... This guy can get up there to melee this artillery. Yes, he can. Excellent. Okay, the 
these guys have all moved. These guys have moved. Okay, well, I made a couple nice finishing touches there. Oh, what about this guy? Yeah, he's moved too. Okay, we're in good shape here. Let's go on to the next phase. Oop, 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 oop. Let's see if I get units. No. Allied defensive fire. Three. Ooh, 14. One gun. God damn it. First shot he gets a gun. Six. Four. He's been doing that a lot. One man. No effect. Five. Fatigue. Nine. No effect. Fifteen. Holy shit. Ten. Three. One. Fourteen. God damn. It took some hits there. French offensive fire. Okay. I guess here's be good start. Seventeen. These guys are in column, so no, 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 no. This guy, he can shoot. Ten. All right. This guy's in column. This guy's in column. Columns. This guy in line. Yep. Forty-three. Holy moly, he's a killer. This artillery will shoot at him. Seventeen. Not bad. Ah, oh, this guy. We'll see what happens to him. Battery. Cannot fire. Oh, shit. I'll have to wait one turn. Okay. He might just actually disorder somebody. We'll see. This battery can fire. Ten. Reduce the skirmishers by ten. That was good. Yeah, I think that's it. Here's the fun part, the melee part. I don't think I have any melees right here. Oh, yeah, I do. This guy's going into the skirmishers. The unit cannot move into the attacking hex. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is kind of bad terrain there. I'll just make sure that that's the right. Yeah, what a sh friggin' shame. What's up here? Column. Okay. I will go after these guys. Ooh, 691 men. It's a big boy. I took 17. He took 5. It looks like he disappeared. Okay, what do we got here? 591. Against. Two skirmishers. Okay, we each took 14, he got knocked back. Oh, advantage defender. Oh, I don't want to do that then. God damn, that guy must be big. Oh, I'm disordered. I guess that's why. So I was 440, now I'm cut down to 220. All right. Let's go after this battery. 
All right, I got two casualties, he got 85, battery disappeared. I got five casualties, he got 64, pushed the battery back, but it's disordered in column, so it's non-usable for the moment. So that takes care of everything here. I don't think I can melee this guy, but it never hurts to try. Nope, that's what I thought. Oh, well. All right, over here, got a disordered skirmisher, 570, 550, they're both about the same. Let's kick this guy into him. Okay, I got four casualties, he's got six. Uh, that was hardly worth it. We've got this battery up here. Let's see if we can get that. Oh, I got seven casualties. He got 16, and the battery was overrun. That is good news. That thing could have caused me some trouble. Okay, we'll do, we did very well on that exchange. Very well. Now it's going to be very interesting to see what his move is going to be. Allied movement. Let's see what you're going to do. Yeah, he's got a line of skirmishers there north of uh, Cherlawa, but let's see how well they hold up against infantry melees. He's got one battalion there. That'll do me some harm. Look at all this artillery out here. One, two, three batteries. He's got one here, which just popped up. Oh shit, I forgot, god damn it. I forgot to melee those guys down there. God damn it. God damn it. Look at that. Shit. Well, maybe that cavalry will rec recover. I'll go after those guys if they run away. God damn it. Oh. Oh, they're coming out there. I'll have to ready that artillery battery. I gotta be more careful. I gotta go over the entire battlefield. I'm gonna do that from now on. I don't care if it takes extra time. I just missed too much shit. Oh, this guy tried to go and melee that artillery. Look at that, and he got routed. No, I'll polish him off next time. That's what happens when you take heavy casualties. You try to move. A lot of times you'll get disordered or routed. That's what happened to that guy. He was throwing a Hail Mary pass thinking he'll try to take out that. Uh... And those, those Prussian uh, skirmishers are pretty big. They could do it. They're just like a, a unit. They're really not a skirmisher. The French have 30, 40, 75 man skirmishers. But the Prussians, Christ, they'll have 150, 175 men skirmishers, just like a unit. That's why it's tough to melee them. In this game, you never know how big the unit is you're trying to melee. You never see their strength. So it's a crapshoot. But with the Prussians, you always have to estimate their skirmishes are going to be big and you're going to take some hits trying to take them out. 
Okay, French defensive fire. Let's see what we got here. And this guy is interesting because it's my move next, and I'm going to get to melee him. That's a disordered guy, I think. Yeah, so he'll probably just run away. But maybe not. Oh, look, he's backed off except for here. He's going to fire on me. He'll, do me. he'll give me some hits there. And this, these two... This guy's disordered. He's a battalion, and he's not. Okay, we'll deal with him. I've got no firing here. Here, we'll fire at these guys. 31 men. Very good. Oh, that guy backed off now. Smart boy. Now that my artillery is finally... We got a disordered column. My artillery will have something to fire at there. Let's do it. 80. <laughs> That's nice. You got to got to get artillery in the city and it's deadly. Oh, got one disordered skirmish. Let's see if we can disorder the other one. 6. And this guy's going to get worked over some more. 43. And the artillery will go at him. 35. Oh, look. These guys hardly moved. Okay. This time I won't forget to take care of them. There were four guys here. One of them must have disappeared when they tried to move. These guys are disordered now. So they recovered from route. The other guy probably didn't. When you try to move a routed guy, that if they've got low morale, um, a lot of times they just vaporize. They just uh, break apart. Okay, so we are doing good here. Uh, don't see anybody else to fire at. Let's look over here. Got this guy. 23, that's good. Okay, all these guys ran away now since this guy got the artillery. I guess that took the starch out of him. Uh, and this guy after to melee next time. Okay, that looks like all the firing now. I said I'm going to go over the map, and I'm going to... Shit, I missed this too. Well, I'll get that on the rebound. See, uh, that's... Yeah, that's it from now the final thing is, I'm going over the map. Just to see what I've fired. I'm too friggin' careless. Well, we certainly hold the northern approaches to Sherlaw. He's not getting any units in there from the north. But see, these guys are going to stream in there. Now, the advantage and disadvantage of having cavalry in a city fight, and he's going to use it. If you move cavalry into... Uh, a village hex, it's automatically disordered. That's the disadvantage. The advantage, and the other disadvantage is it can't shoot. But the advantage is it can't be meleeed, which means you've got to shoot, you've got to kill it to the last man because the infantry cannot melee cavalry. It's kind of stupid as it sounds. If they're in a village hex, the cavalry is not going to be on horseback, <laughs> standing in the street. They're going to be hidden in buildings. So, in effect, they become infantry. I'm going to have to write the company. Uh, well, I keep saying that, but I never have enough time. An e email. Because, really, they if they're in a village hex, they should change into disordered infantry. But in this game... They can remain on their horses, so as long as they're on their horses, you can't melee them. So basically, you got to shoot them to death. And to do that, you got to move artillery up next to them and just keep blasting them so, till they are no more. But they can hold you up for a considerable amount of time. That's why he's moving cavalry towards the city or towards a village, whatever this is. This might be actual city. This is pretty big. So that's what he's doing there. Okay, so let me check my firing here. Um, yeah, we got a you know, over here. 
Okay. Now we can go on to the next phase. Allied offensive fire. Three. Seven. Five. Fatigue. Two. No effect. Three. Five. That's acceptable. No effect. One. Two. One. Yeah. Seven. Thirty-five. Yeah, that's the big hitter. Fourteen. Allied melees. Got any suicide melees? Forty to thirteen. Sixty-four to twenty-nine. Holy shit. So he disordered that other guy. Why did he want to do that? Wow. That was not a good move. This guy was causing me heavy casualties and it would have been tough to take out. Now he's disordered. Okay. All right, so. Well, we're going to go up here and start taking out these skirmishers. And this guy's disordered. him out back there. This guy's disordered. Well, this guy's in column. We'll put him in line. We'll bump him up. Ah, oh, shit. He can't move or shit. This is bad terrain up here. Okay, this guy's going to unlimber. Oh. And he'll turn to the right. These guys are in column, huh? This guy's in square. Isn't that nice? So let's turn this guy. Let's put him into line. And let's see if we can move down here one hex. We can't move two, but one's pretty good. So we'll move him down here. Put the squeeze on these guys. Now, let's move our cavalry through here. Doesn't look like anything's there. Shit, this guy's disordered, but he's in column. So, let's see if we pick up anything here. Yeah, some skirmishers. It's okay. Now, let's see. What are these guys? Disordered. Oh, look at what's here. Two disordered skirmishers plus a battalion in good order. Okay, so we're going to have a fight there. That's for sure. Let's continue moving down this road to hem these guys in. And we'll move some artillery down there. Uh. 
Oh, we discovered some more scum. It's everywhere. It's trying to come in to the battle. Let's see. Let's put one of these leaders here. Maybe he can do some help with the melees. Okay. Got some supply there. That's good. Who's here? Um... Put the leaders down here. Um, bring another guy up here. He's disordered, huh? Hey, good. guy up there. Oh, this is nice. We'll see if he stays in that uh, in that hex for very long. I don't think I have enough movement to put the infantry underneath. Well, I'll do that next time. Nope, I don't. Okay, more guys coming up here. This would Calvary ever recover? No. Okay, we'll melee him. We'll melee him. Okay. All right. This time I'll remember. Look at all these guys coming up. Yeah, basically... Instead of fighting the Battle of Lene, we fight a big battle in Cherlois. Because the Prussians tend to commit everything they have to that battle. And they don't just get pushed back, they get eliminated. Oh shit, what have I got here? I'm going to take these guys off. Because we've got cavalry coming up. Yeah, it's a battle of annihilation. You might as well think of Stalingrad when you think of Cherlois if the uh, AI is playing the uh, allies. 
because you're always going to have to fight for it. It's going to be, uh, you better, that, that, you'll learn how to fight uh, uh, city battles. You need plenty of artillery. And I'm sure he's going to get that cavalry in there. That's what he's going to do. So that's, that's going to be a fight to the finish. Okay. Now. This is a column here. Okay, we're going to fire on him. These skirmishers, I can't melee from there, but okay, he can go in the line. We're going to just have to beat these guys down. That's why he leaves them behind. We're just going to put these guys in line and just keep pounding these guys. Disordered. Disordered. Now this guy... See if he can. He's in column. Let's see if he can cross into this hex. Shit, he can't. There's some immovable, immovable hex here that you can't pass, no matter what. So I'm gonna put him into line. And he'll just start shooting at these skirmishers. Meanwhile, this guy will go up here. We'll see if we can't take those guys out by uh, melee. This guy's disordered. This guy's in column. That's good. We'll go up there. This guy's in column. That's good. We'll go up there. And this guy's disordered. Uh... Christ, it's about 15 or 20. Of those leaders, I gotta put a guards unit up there. Wish I had one more artillery battery to put right there. Oh. Gotta uh, limber him up. Let's move him here to cover the flank. And the guard we will put in line and put him underneath. Let's see, that's what you have to do in a city. you got to come up next to these guys. And you're going to take two turns of fire. And you're going to hope 
you aren't disordered, then you can go in the line and and shoot at him. So you want to come up behind him if you can and deploy so you, you don't get shot up. But then all he has to do is retreat and then you have to start the process all over again. So you want to disorder him so he can't change formation if he's in column. If he's in line, it doesn't matter because if he's disordered, he can still move into a hex that would disorder him because he's disordered already. So, okay, let's get back to business here. So we got more units to bring across. This engineer is weak, but he's holding a good position. Uh, I've got six movement points, so I should be able to bring them up. So we'll squeeze the engineer up here. There. And then... Turn units off. I want to see what the terrain is around here. Uh, it's none too good. Well, we'll unlimber him, I think. Bring him up here. Oop, probably can't. Jeez. That takes a lot of movement, huh? Well. Let's bring this guy up. Let's see if he can go over there. He can. Excellent. There, he can go there, good. Uh, we'll bring reinforcements up here. A supply up here because I'm going to run out. I'll put him back on the road. Put this guy on. Okay. This guy's going to go in the line now. Oh shit, he can't. No movement. Ah, uh, nuts. I moved these guys already. Yeah. So we want to hem these guys in so they can't switch back and forth. And then, basically, you just have to kill them with firepower. You just have to keep shooting at them until they don't exist. Or break up. Break up, yeah. But they're going to take a lot of casualties. But it's steady work. It's like I'm working on the railroad. All the live long day. I'm shooting down Prussians. All the live long day. Okay. Now let's see if he's moved down the road here. I'm leery. He might be sitting right there. Yeah, he is. Where is he? There. Okay, he's got a zone of control. So, I'll just bypass it and go here. Oh, he's got some more guys here. Next turn, I'll, 
I'll go in a line. We'll flush them out of the woods here. A lot of rats in there. Um, uh, what do we want to do here? What is this? Plowed fields? Yeah. See if I have enough movement. Control D is going into a square. Let's see if I have enough to do that. I don't know why it's going to matter that much. I do. I'll go in a square. Then I'll put this artillery in there. The next turn I'll unlimber it. Bring this supply up there. Put this supply up here. What do we got here? I don't see anybody. just leaders yeah well we'll just put them back here well he can only choose one unit some help infantry huh we'll start working our way through the fields there this is mounted, good. Oh shit. Well, I guess I'm okay. Bring them up to there, to there, to there. Start working our way through the fields. that far and see what we want to do with them. They go left or right. <coughs> okay, we got to fight these guys. So, this guy's limbered. Guy's disordered. So we're gonna Oh, we've got a he is limbered, why can't he move? Oh, the cavalry might be too big for him. So we can't move on top of him, okay. 
Now let's uh, bring this guy up to shoot at this guy. This guy's in column. We'll put him in line. We'll bring him up to shoot at this guy. That ought to shoot his pants off. Literally. Be so many cannonballs flying. Um... This cavalry up here. This guy. He's disordered. Okay. So he'll move in this hex. And he's disordered in line, which is a good thing. Oh, that's the end of his movement. So I'll turn him around and he can still shoot. Clear the road here. Yeah, this guy's recovered. This guy's disordered, so he'll go there. And take his place. Okay, now this guy should be able to back out. Yep, he can. He'll go over here, and he'll deploy next time. Meanwhile, this guy will go underneath him. Okay. So what about this guy? give this guy a few retreats he'll zip out this way not any other way which would inconvenience me and I'm going to set up if he burps out over here I'll set this guy up to melee him okay And we might as well have this guy shoot at him. That might weaken him. And let's put this guy into line. Okay. I believe we're all set here. And this guy will hang loose and see if he's needed up here. And then these guys can continue on the road. Well, we had kind of a slow start, but we're making up for it now. charged. Oh, fuck. That's right. He's disordered now. God damn it. Well, he'll just have to hold that guy. I don't think there's much coming up this road after these guys. Yeah, that's right. I designated him for a charge, and because I didn't make the charge, he got disordered. What are you going to do? Oh, actually, I've still got cavalry over here, so I can go get them if I want. I'm not sure it's going to be worth my trouble. It's like I said, if if these are the only guys here, uh, 
I might be past him by the time he can do any damage. But there could be some other people wandering around there. So maybe I'll have this cavalry brigade take a look-see. See if anybody's hiding. Okay. Oh, got some artillery coming up. That's always handy. Clears everything out here. So that should pretty much be it. Hmm. This guy should probably go into line and face north. It's one of those guys that are probably going to try to come down and shoot at him. At least he can shoot back. Okay. Well, that's okay. That's good. We'll flush any skunks out of these woods, or we'll just go to this road and take out all these skirmishers. Interested to see what this Lancer does. That's a powerful unit. These guys were melee, and these guys are slowly getting crushed. Okay. Everybody's moved here, I think. Yep. Oh, let's see if we get anybody, any reinforcements. Oh, yeah. What? Ah, Jesus. I didn't move these. I forgot all about them. Well, let's uh, rectify that. Send them to Stalingrad. We've got an artillery battery. That's always useful. In a city fight, that's a necessity. Okay. Oh, he already showed up because I clicked on him. Yeah, now I'm getting plenty of infantry. All right. 
right, who else? Jesus, 55 minutes have gone by. It's unbelievable. This game really moves fast. Oh, more here. These guys move, yeah. Oh, Calvary. That's always nice to see. Well, we'll probably just do, got five, four or five minutes. We'll do the next phase and that'll be it. That'll be uh, enemy defensive fire. Let's see what casualties he gets. 16, I knew that guy would take a hit. 10, fatigue, 12. Yeah, it's never cheap when you're city fighting. You always take hits, two, no effect, two, four, 11, uh, one, one, two, four, two, yeah, he'll shoot everything, no effect, 15, holy shit, two, that's a big skirmisher, three, to deal out that kind of punishment. Five, 16, well, that's a one, that's a battalion. And uh, fatigue, six. And uh, Prussian battalions are huge. So you get next to it. Okay, so we're gonna end it here. You get next to it, you're gonna get hurt. Okay, that's it for today, and we'll continue on.